My name is Deborah Hamlin and I am the Adult Safeguarding Specialist for the Western Health and Social Care Trust. Safeguarding is the work we do to minimise and manage risk to adults who may be vulnerable. It is about preventing harm by providing high quality care and raising awareness of adult abuse. This includes learning from incidents to improve care and importantly by providing effective responses to allegations of harm and abuse in line with regional and local policies and procedures. Living a life that is free from harm and abuse is a fundamental right of every person. All of us need to act as good neighbours and citizens in looking out for one another and to seek to prevent the isolation which can easily lead to abusive situations and put adults at risk of harm. There is growing recognition that prevention of abuse is everyone's business. Efforts to empower and support individuals to make choices and manage risks are at the heart of adult safeguarding practice across many statutory, independent and community sector organisations. Adult safeguarding social work practitioners work alongside many agencies to enable people to keep themselves safe. These include the PSNI, the Housing Executive, Women's Aid and many other providers of services. A vulnerable adult is someone over 18 years of age who may be in need of services because of an illness, disability, age or is resident in a care facility or someone who is unable to take care or protect themselves from significant harm or exploitation. Abuse is the physical, psychological, emotional, financial or sexual maltreatment or neglect of a vulnerable adult by another person. Abuse can occur in a relationship where there is the expectation of trust. Sometimes abuse is perpetrated by someone who breaks that trust, whether they be formal or informal carers, staff or family members or others. It also includes domestic abuse and abuse can happen anywhere. If you have a concern about abuse of a vulnerable adult, you can talk to the social workers in the Adult Safeguarding Service. It is important that concerns of abuse are dealt with quickly and in a reasonable, lawful and proportionate way. The social work team will talk with you to make sure the rights and wishes of the adult in need of protection are heard. This keeps the person in control of decisions and informed of progress of any investigations. There are a number of ways in which a vulnerable adult can be supported to make decisions about what happens after they experience abuse or a possible crime. If you need emotional or communication support to tell your story, this can be arranged for you. In some situations, there may be some things that need to happen straight away to keep you safe. Everyone has the right to live a life free from abuse. It is important to tell someone you trust. If you're worried that someone has, is or may be hurting you or someone you know, support is available for everyone.